Hello, this is just a quick simple video on how to get a, a soundboard that works really well. Alright, your first step is to go to this website. Go to that in the link in the description. What you want to do after that is you want to click this. You want to download. And since I already have it, it's it doesn't really matter. But all you want to do is drag it to your desktop. Extract it to extract files. And then press OK. I use WinZip. Or you could use 7-Zip. It doesn't really matter. Now you can delete that old file. You can open this one. Alright, so now you can go here and you can find, depending on what your computer is, if it's 64 or if it's 32, 32, go click this one. If, you, if it's 64, you want to click this one. None of this other stuff matters. Um, to check if you have a 64 or 32, you can just find a simple video or just look up a tutorial. What you want to do is you want to do is right click on whatever version. I have 64. And you want to do run as administrator. You won't be able to see what I see, but it says, do you want to run it? And you would say yes. Then it's going to show this. For me, it shows remove driver because I already have it. So I'm just not going to touch it, but it's going to, for, it's going to say for you to install a driver. What you're going to want to do is you want to click that and it should like do its thing. Then it should finish up real quickly. And it should say like restart your computer or whatever. So then restart your computer and you'll be good. And then you can continue on after that. Or you can do it right now before you restart your computer. Now what you want to do is you want to go to the second link in the description. All you want to do and once you're in Dropbox is just click the download button and you want to do direct download to directly download to your computer. You should download it, drag it to your desktop or whatever. It's gonna be normal but it's right there. What I'd like to do is I would just drag it out and delete that. And you can open this, and you can do extract files, press yes, then you have your thing right there. You can delete this other thing, and you can open this. You don't need to worry about any of this other stuff, except this. This is the only thing you need to worry about. Once you double click that, you don't need to run it as administrator or anything like that. So after that is, what you can do is you can, it's going to make this document after you close it, just to save your whatever you had in it. So if you want to make it so it's simple and easy and you can put this file somewhere else, all you want to do is you want to do create shortcut. It's going to make this thing called shortcut, whatever, I'll drag that to your desktop. So now you can just easily open this up and it'll do exact same thing as you did there. So now you can close that. And if you want to add uh, a song, it, okay, so if you want to add a song, you want to go to add. For me, I have all my songs in here. I'll just choose the Burger King Foot Lettuce because that's a funny one. First, you want to do stop. Stop hotkey. What, I, what you want to do is you want to do either control or alt. Shift does not work. So you cannot just press a letter. Also, we just do this. And you have to press one of the other keys. The modifiers, as they call it. So what I'd like to do with this one is alt grave. It's not going to say grave, but it's going to say something. And it's going to work. So now it's alt grave. But that's not grave. See? Now I, could, now I can go to this one, which shows where my file is. Then I could do alt 1. And it will show D1. I don't know why it does that, but it does. Okay. So if you want to hear it for yourself, what you're going to... I want to do is you're gonna find your speakers for me I'm using the blue Yeti so I can just turn this down so that it sounds a bit normal volume for me now if you want other people to hear it you want to go to cable input and you want to set this to I like it at 75 okay if you start it I'm not sure if you guys will hear this but I'll just add it in the recording if you don't Burger, Burger King, King foot, foot lettuce. lettuce okay so you guys got there hear it what you can do is you can just download the that stuff with a thing called uh, 4k video downloader it's not a virus or anything it's actually really good all right so you you have your thing Burger, Burger King, King foot, foot lettuce and what you can do is you want to have it as this and if you want to hear it you want to do speakers or whatever you use to hear you can find that in the whatever you can go down here and choose sounds for some reason my computer doesn't do that so i go to here and then go to audio devices so right in here i have all my audio devices and i have cable output and these two are talking this is the one i'm speaking into the blue yeti what i want to do is once you have cable output and you have cable input you want to make it so whenever you have it for discord you want to make it for like fortnite or discord whatever you want to make it so the Input device is cable output. Should make a weird sound. Then you want your output device and you want to set that to default as your speakers. So then you could just, you could set it like this or you could set it like this. So then what you want to do is you, if you want them to hear you at the exact while, if you want them to hear you while you're playing the sounds like I was doing, what you want to do is you want to go to listen, listen to this device, set that on and put that to cable input and then press apply. So right now it's going through both of them. If I, and if I uncheck this, 
You actually couldn't hear me while I was doing that, because I have to fix OBS. But, um, yeah. You couldn't hear me, because I unchecked this, and it's go and it's only listening for this. So you always want to have it like that. So, now, what you can do, is you can do... What I, I like to do, is cable output default, and then for playback, go to speakers, and then put your speakers, and then press apply, and then, okay, then you're okay. But make sure to make it so when if you, if you want them to hear you, you want to put it so it listen to this device and set it to cable output. Alright, so now you should be good. You want to check this cable input, put it at 75 or whatever. And if you want to hear it yourself, but a little bit quieter so you can still hear over your friends or whatever, you want I, I, I like to keep it around 20. So all you can do is you can just keep adding songs and songs. But remember, you have to press start. And if you want to remove some, just click that and that. It's it's really simple, honestly. And there's no viruses, I, I would say. See ya. Hopefully that helped you guys for getting the soundboard. Bye.